and struggle for internet are mobile homes and RVs. Representatives say the launch is a huge opportunity for those living in the area to get access. Really, if you look at the mobile homes across the, uh, the United States, there's roughly 7 million homes out there. And literally, just about every park that we run into, we talk to the ownership, they have pretty poor internet choices. It's can expect to have one gigabyte metrical internet for $50 a month. Starting today, overnight closures of the I-2 westbound main lanes and frontage road begins. The closures are part of the Far Internet program project. Sorry, crews began demolishing the Harlington to Edinburgh connector over the weekend. The closures are expected to be in place until mid-August. We have more specifics, including detours and times, on ValleyCentral.com. There will be a great event featuring music in our community, and everyone's invited. Danielle's got the scoop, right, Danielle? Oh, Natasha, do you like music? A hundred percent. Do you I like live music? Oh my God, my favorite, especially. <laughs> are you kidding me? Yes. <laughs> well, then you're gonna love this event. You're gonna have to go with me. Is that okay? Oh, you, I'm in, girl. You know it. <laughs> I knew you would be in, and I think Chris will be in too. So this is the 956 Summer Fest event, and it's gonna be a pretty big one for all in our Rio Grande Valley community. Now, this is the second annual version of the event and it's pretty much anticipated to be bigger and better than before. Now my good friends popular loner the band are going to be taking the main stage getting the crowd all pumped up plus other features are going to be on site including Crystal Poppin band which also is going to be live on stage with other amazingly big names from the 956. Now there will also be plenty of food vendors on location which is great because you know you can't have a party without great tasting food and that includes goodies outside and and inside the stage. Now the event's also going to feature big crazy production and costume car show and the entire thing is family friendly. Now it's all happening this Saturday. It's over in the city of Mission from 8 in the evening to 2 in the morning. Lots of time to check it out and you can check out eventbrite.com if you want to attend. Now guys, food, live music, and a car show. What else could you ask for? Am I right? It sounds like my type of event. I think we're all going to have to go. True. You said <laughs> two in the morning. Did You caught that, right? I yeah. did. Oh. Yeah, there's a lot of time for you to go out there. The party's yes. going to go on and on. <laughs> I'm you know there. what, sign me in, especially with our schedule. Yes. We can definitely make it work, right? <laughs> we just have to take a couple naps during the day, but I think we'll be okay. Oh, for sure. Yeah, <laughs> I think we'll be able and ready. You know, that. You, they say 30 minutes nap is the perfect time, but I think we're going to need like a four hour nap. Maybe, maybe you know, yeah. four hours. Yeah, yeah give just or a take. little bit. Maybe four and a half. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's awesome. And then it's a good photo op, too, because you can take pictures with the cars. And I mean, you could post it on your Instagram. Instagram content. You know, right yeah, for it's sure. perfect. We have a big car <laughs> fan club here across the valley. I've oh, yeah. seen the car shows that are going mm -hmm. on in the parking lots. It's quite a good event. Yeah, and it also it's our opportunity to support local bands. So that's amazing. Perfect for everybody in the family. Yes. Let's do it. For sure. Thank you so much, Danielle. You're welcome. A recent report looked at the bacteria levels for Texas shores, where the island stands in clean beaches. And planning that last minute trip, we'll show you a beach resort like vacation just outside of Houston in this week's Destination Texas. We are expecting mostly muggy conditions right now, but of course, very quiet out there. Currently 81 degrees out on the island, 79 degrees with that dew point temp with winds fairly calm, and we are expecting those calm winds for today. So we're still going to be hot and humid, but we do have a chance for some showers that could move inland later on this afternoon. As we look at that high temperature forecast tips, once again in the hundreds as we go into tomorrow, but we're also going to be dealing with some haze due to some Saharan dust. I'll